Hi everyone, Joe for Jaspi's CaseBreaks.com coming at you with another three box autograph baseball break from Fanatic. Fanatics under wraps 2.0. Just as a reminder, once again, any and all multi sign autographs will go to that one spot right there. One spot gets you nine, so let's nine tuple you up. There's one, two, three. And nine. There we go. Let's get your names into a fresh list. Let's get the player players into a fresh list right here. And let's roll it and randomize names and teams three and a five eight times. Names and players eight times. One, two, three, four, five six, seven, and eight. Sure, we got Josh down to Eric. This, the results in a different tab here. Three and a five, eight times for the players. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. After A, we got Dale Murphy all the way down to Lucas Giolito. So as always, I'm just—I'll show you the list as is, and then I'll show you uh, the list sorted by your first names. So there's the first group here. Look at Jeremy Port with the any and all multi-sign autographs. So I just want to get this on the recording, so you can look back and audit this if you want to. Make sure everything's fine. Everything is. All right, now let's sort this list by your first names. All right, so Eric, there are your players right there. Jeremy Port, in addition to your any and all multi-time baseballs, there are your other players. And feel free to start trading if you want to. Jeremy's got a ton of players here. Good luck, Jeremy. Your last spot mojo players right there as well. Josh Melton. Kevin. Mike. Sam. And Sam, you have the rest. There you go. We're gonna pause the video just for a little bit. When we come back, we're gonna see if there's any trades. Then we'll have the three box break and uh, America's favorite game, Who Am I? So stick around, be right back. All right, hi, welcome back everybody. No deals were done, so let's get into it. We've got a few more breaks of this already filled up, happening a little bit later today. This is break uh, 17 if you're keeping track. We've got some more coming up, so check the schedule. Pretty important today, even more so than other days. Check the schedule to see when your break is happening. All right, <clears throat> excuse me. Let's see who gets this one. All right, who am I? An active baseball player, 32 years old, was originally drafted by the Royals in the 32nd round, but I think he opted to go to college and then he ended up getting drafted by the Cardinals in the 22nd round. He's got a lifetime 254. 95 home runs, 410 hits, 272 RBIs, lifetime 818 OPS, had 22 homers last season. Wow, he finished ninth in MVP voting in 2020. Uh, I think you're kind of on the right track with Colton Wong, not Chris Bryant. But he is, he is with the Brewers.
Not Tommy Edmond. Not Goldie. I think Goldie has more than 95 home runs lifetime. Not Yelich. He was with the Nationals last year. He signed a minor league deal with the Brewers this year. Got an invite to spring training. I think most of you may remember him as a Yankee. He was with the Yankees between 2018 and 2021. Cardinals 2017 to 18. Yankees 18 to 21. Padres for a season. Uh, traded to the Nationals. I guess in a pandemic shortened season in 2020, he was the MLB home run leader. I'd be surprised if he this is good. This is gonna to go to Jeremy Port. Now he hit you. There you go. Sport Port's got it. It's Luke Voigt hitting you with a Slam Diego inscription as well. player All right, next player has an MVP, a gold active player, an MVP, a gold glove, two batting titles. Two All-Stars appearances, made two All-Star teams, and a three-time Silver Slugger. He finished MVP one year, and the next year finished second in MVP voting. He's played for two teams his entire career. Has had a rough season, rough couple seasons as of late, but he need, it'd be cool to see him get back on track. Uh, throws right, but bats left. From Thousand Oaks, California, was a first round pick by the Marlins. Not, not Machado, not Goldie, not Miggy, not Altuve. Yes, Yelich. There you go. And that's you, Kevin. This is a guy that needs to, needs to bounce back. That'd be good for the, good for the hobby. Christian Yelich hitting you with that MVP inscription. There are your authentication stickers right there. And there's his auto. Got a cool autograph. All right, there you go, Kevin. Yeah, Giancarlo Stanton is uh, is from he's from Thousand Oaks. I think Giancarlo Stanton went to Sh high school in Sherman Oaks. Went to a private high school in Sherman Oaks. But yeah, Yel Yelich is a uh, is from Thousand Oaks. He's from the area too. All right, and the final. Final one. We got an active pitcher. We got an active pitcher. Um, 32 years old, drafted by the Giants. A first round pick way back when. Sixth overall out of high school from Dallas, Georgia. 
He's got a, he has a lifetime 342 ERA. Almost 1,200 strikeouts, a 1-2 whip. Last year, a pretty good season last year. A 2-8-2 ERA. Went 12-7, and over 26 starts. 153 innings pitch, 163 strikeouts. A 5.1 war. I don't think he ever played for the Giants, though. Looks like he was drafted by the Giants, but made his major league debut with the Mets. And he's on a different team now. Yep, Sporeport's got it. Zach Wheeler had a really nice season last year. Was an all-star the season before. There's the all-star game ball. There's his autograph. You should have all of the authentication stickers right there. And there you go. And that's Eric Clicks with that one. There you go, Eric. There you go, everybody. I'm Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. I'll see you a little bit later tonight for the next three-ball break. Bye-bye.